Hi guys, Ash47 here and welcome back. Today we've got something incredibly special for you. Let's go ahead and start a brand new game. You can already see straight off the bat, something's a little bit different here. Go ahead and continue. This is actually the neon mod. We're going ahead and modified most of the graphics to do with Octageddon. As you can see, all of this stuff here, all neon. Maybe not quite the sea ocean. Oh, there you go. Even the sea ocean down here is actually modified. Just missed that graphic there, that's fine. Let's go ahead and build an amazing Octageddon. We're just going to play through this for a little bit and have a look at these cool graphics. As you can see, neon mod. Look at that. Literally, fully modded into the game, 100% custom, never been done before. This is brand new. No one else has ever done this. So you're seeing this for the very first time. I haven't even seen what this looks like yet. So we're going to discover this together, guys. Whoa, this is awesome. This is genuinely awesome. All right, I'm really excited for this one. Okay, even the explosion, this is so cool. This is so very cool. All right, let's make it ready. Watch the urchin, I'm going to make him start shooting. Here he goes. Here he goes. He's shooting at his neon ones. Oh man, this is so cool. Now, as you can see, there are some graphical glitches here. You can see the explosions. They have like a white border on them. I don't know what's with that. That's fine. This is version 1, guys. Version 1. And as you can see, we have definitely got proper modding now. We can modify every single graphic. That's right, guys. We can literally replace anything and everything now. So this took a lot of work to get to this stage. To actually be able to modify these, it's incredibly difficult. And yeah, we got there though. We got there, guys. It is so worth it. Look how awesome this looks. I'm so glad I went ahead and did this. It, yeah, but so much work, it was worth it. And have a look at this. Okay, so the angler, as you can see, he's the one facing directly up right now. I quite like... How cool is the searchlight there? That is a really cool searchlight. I'm excited to see what else we can do with this. So it might even be possible for us to release some graphics mods or some custom maps or something from this. This is so awesome. You can literally modify everything and make something completely new out of this. So now we can edit the sounds, we can edit the graphics, we can edit the layout of the levels, we can edit the speed of the attacks and stuff like that. We can almost make a completely custom game out of this. This is awesome. So there is so much more coming. Have a look at the T-Rex. So he's the one facing to the right right now. He has like a little string inside his mouth. It looks incredibly weird. And, oh, chop it! There we go. It's like a little graphical glitch. Have a look just here. Already? When he opens it up. It's kind of interesting. I'm wondering why... See, a lot of these guys have... You can kind of see the sprites around them. Have a look. So straight up here, you can see probably the edge of the image or something. And it seems to have like a white border on it. Incredibly weird. I don't know what's with that. Hopefully we'll get that fixed up in the future. Maybe it's just because of the stylization I applied to these images. It could just be that Photoshop put a white border on them for some reason. It looks, it looks incredibly weird, but... I mean, it doesn't take away from the experience. Whoa, look at that! That is so cool. You got some shells. Oh, man, that looks awesome. That's just awesome. All right, we're going to keep adding stuff here. We've got our starfish guy. I'm going to add a whole bunch of tentacles here. Yes, Octogenon. Get some more anglers. We've got the dragon here. Now, I don't remember if we actually modified uh, the dragon flames. So I'm excited to see... If, if that actually changed or not. I can't remember if I actually did that. Coral. That looks really nice. And we're going to get the lobster as well. Damn. This is so cool. What do you guys think? Do you think this is awesome? Let us know down below in the comment section. Alright. Here we are. Much more tanky. And let's do the fire. Whoa. Okay. No. The, the fire is just a mess. You can see this is the fire up here. In the very top. It's just like a complete mess. It looks really cool. Don't get me wrong. But it's a complete mess. Absolute complete mess. But that's fine. Let's just keep going and see exactly what we can get. I want to see the starfish guy attack. Once we get some enemies on the screen. And, oh no, this is one. If everything doesn't just die. Oh man, I guess the bee's, the bee's tracking on. Now let's do it. Alright, he's attacking. He's attacking. Oh, it wasn't that impressive because there's not enough guys on the screen. This is actually hard mode. If you look down the bottom right here, you can see the red text indicating hard mode. But, I mean, I don't know. I guess it's the first stage of hard mode, so it's not that exciting. Not that much happening. But that's fine. We can get an idea of the creatures. Everything's coming at us. It looks really cool. Don't get me wrong. Yeah, it's kind of interesting. Look at this starfish guy. There's actually some weird texture bleeding through from the top there. It almost looks like it's being duplicated from the bottom of him. Which is really interesting, actually. Alright, let's see if we can get the treasure chest. I like the treasure chest. It looks really nice. Come here. Smash, 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 smash. Yes, we smashed it. Huge wave of enemies approaching, guys. A huge wave. Here they come, guys. And, ooh, it doesn't seem that huge to me. You know what I'm excited for? I'm excited for the bosses. I did, in fact, modify the graphics of the bosses, and I'm excited to see exactly what they look like. 
So we're going to go, and the next level is actually going to be a boss. That is going to be exciting to see. Okay, come on, let's see if we can clean this up quickly and get straight to the boss. And oh, there's a guy coming in from the top. Got him. Okay, a couple more enemies up here, and then we should be pretty good. Yep, there we go. Here comes the. Look at that. Look at that thing. That is so cool. That's ship with the shell in it. That is awesome. Yeah, I don't like this background that much. It's, it doesn't look that amazing. All right, let's add some more tentacles, guys. What else do we have? So we got the narwhal. I'm excited to see what that does, actually. We got the firefly. Got the pet. We got the porcupine here. Got the good old penguin. Let's add some more tentacles here. You never have enough tentacles. I reckon the normal tentacles just look awesome. Seriously, they look incredible. Crab. Oh, got the crab DNA in there. T-Rex DNA is coming in, guys. We'll just go ahead and attach that. Nice. Let's add some more tentacles. A whole bunch more tentacles. Very nice. Snapping turtle goes in here. And we've got finally the chicken. How cool does that snapping turtle look, though? There we go. That's in. Done. All right. This is the boss level. The first boss level inside of the ocean. So hopefully there's going to be a couple of enemies. And then we're going to be able to fight the boss. I'm excited to see what the boss looks like. I'm very excited. How cool does my Octagon look right now, though? Seriously. He just looks insane. I like this guy so much. Oh, man. This graphic style just looks awesome. Okay. Should be the boss time now. Let's have a look here. Okay, a large enemy's approaching. What is he going to look like, guys? This is exciting. First time, look at this. Here he is. Oh, man. He's a little bit glitchy, but he looks pretty awesome. Look at him go, look at him go! Yes, Neon Boss. Oh, those explosions. Those explosions are cool. Okay, he's about to, there we go, he's blowing up. Look how crazy those explosions look. They look pretty awesome. Boom! Alright, so we're going to be going onto land now. We're going to continue this journey onto land. Now, I don't think it's really worth putting any more, except for the dolphin fin. I'll add the dolphin fin, that's really awesome. I don't think we have any dolphin fins. Alright, we added the dolphin fin. Nothing else really worth adding at this stage. And we're going to go straight into it, guys. This is going to be cool. Alright, here's the people. They're going to run away from us. So obviously we left all the backgrounds as is. I could have changed them, but I quite like having just the neon guy in a normal background. And with the neon enemies as well. Oh, is it going to explode? Yep, here it goes. Wow, the neon enemies look so cool. It makes it more obvious what's enemy as well. Okay. I want to take out this treasure chest. Oh, nah, I'm going to leave it. We don't need treasure. Honestly, we're pretty fine. Take out all those guys. Boom, boom, boom. Wow. Huge wave of Venus is approaching. We'll just take down this building nice and quickly. Here it comes. Shell building. Shell building. And it's gone. Awesome. Bonk, bonk, bonk. I like that shell thing. That looks really cool as well. Okay, let's continue. We've got one more level and then we'll be on to the boss level. Now, there's nothing really worth adding here. Except for maybe we'll add probably the elephant DNA. Just because we can. And we'll probably add the goldfish because I don't think we have any. There we go. Done. So the elephant DNA really good for the final mission. I don't think we're going to ever get that far. Because it is kind of slow to sit here and play through the entire game. But we will get to the first boss in this area. I'm pretty sure. Assuming it doesn't crash. I think it should be pretty stable. We've been pretty good so far. And we're going to see what he looks like. So that should be that meat guy. Um, I forget what his name is. But the meat grinder guy. We're going to smash him up, destroy him. Alright. How cool does that ship in the sky look with the laser? That just looks awesome. Warning. You drove enemies is approaching, guys. It's going to... It's going to... They're never going to get here. We're going to smash this shell building. That's it. Yeah, that's it. They look cool. They look really cool. Those fish. Alright. So we're going to be going on to the boss level now. I'm excited to see this. Boss level. Anything worth adding? Not really. I think we're pretty fine. Our Octagon is basically very, very OP. Doesn't get much more OP. I mean, we can keep adding tentacles, but it's just going to add lag. And we're already sufficiently strong. The only thing worth adding is more dolphin fins. So, unless we see dolphin fins, I'm not going to bother. Alright. Halfway there, we're approaching the boss. I'm excited to see what he looks like. I want to see... I'm gonna, probably not going to kill him straight away. We'll probably let him try and attack us for a little bit. Whoa. That's a cool boss. I want to see him throw the knives and stuff. Fresh meat. It's the butcher. That's what he's called. Yeah, we go. He's even throwing the... See, look at this. Stylized knives. Whoa. Okay. It's time to take this guy out. You're going down, butcher. Boom. All right. That's it. I've had enough of you, butcher. 
You are going down. And there's one more surprise coming. Oh, oh we just barely managed to dodge that. There's one more surprise. Check this out, guys. Just over here. The Eiffel Tower. Whoa. Okay, it's a bit messed up. But that's pretty awesome. Check that out. Stylized Eiffel Tower. Boom. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed this. If you have enjoyed this, make sure to smash that like button. If you guys want to see us make more awesome mods and continue the development of all these hacking tools, make sure to subscribe to our channel. Thanks a lot for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next episode.